Would you suggest people? Because obviously there's people who've been eating shit on crypto recently and NFTs and shit. Like you're very smart with your money. Like yeah. how how involved did you get with the crypto space? Not very. <laughs> smart guy. <laughs> I had a lot of advice and, you know, I feel like we took the right ones. But I did do a, a some, you know, to some degree. Yeah, yeah, you but dabbled. It's, yeah, yeah, it's not, you know, me turning a lot of money into Non money, yeah. A lot of uh, <laughs> well, you know, you saw like a lot of people are like not e probably not even to their own knowledge, like were like a part of Ponzi schemes, like artists and like even the dude from the Sacramento Kings. A uh, uh, what scheme? Like like some of these NFT, they call them like rug pools. Okay, so they they are like uh, what's uh, De'Aaron Fox who signed a hundred and eighty five million dollar contract for the Kings, mm -hmm. launched his own NFT with a company. Mm -hmm. And then I guess they sold like when everyone bought in and mm -hmm. it dipped. So they're like, there's like, that's like, that's like, yeah, that's they're yeah. like, it's a lot of looking great. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So that dude's in Panama somewhere chilling. Well, also, like, you signed a $185 million contract with the Kings, bro. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. Well, yeah, nah, you can't do that shit. I believe it though, because it's like, that's all that they were going after is like high profile the quick money people. and it's also the quick it's like that quick nut that's shit, the yeah. only way to get value that quick is to go after somebody who's like high value i mean mm -hmm. you know what i mean so it's like if you have a lighter and it's like it's not really a lighter until fucking like lebron it's got the touches Kush on, the, on the logo lebron touched it then it's like oh yeah now we got these i got lebron's lighter yeah it's like it's cooler now you know what i'm saying so they were doing that with like nfts and all of those companies they were just using artists to like promote them and bring value to themselves but that shit wasn't about nothing